Let's learn about CAG 2.1 Success Criterion 2.4.1 Bypass Blocks. This criterion requires that a mechanism be provided to allow users to bypass blocks of content that are repeated on multiple web pages. This is especially important for users who rely on assistive technologies to navigate web pages, as they may need to bypass blocks of content to reach the main content of a web page. To implement Success Criterion 2.4.1 in code, here are some examples of best practices. Use skip links. A skip link is a link at the top of a web page that allows users to skip over blocks of content and go directly to the main content of the web page. This can be implemented using HTML and CSS. Use appropriate ARIA attributes. Use appropriate ARIA attributes, such as ARIA label, ARIA describe B, or ARIA label B, to provide context and information about the skip link and the block of content being skipped. Here's an example of how to use skip links in HTML in this example. The HTML code includes a skip link at the top of the page with an href attribute that points to the main content of the page. The class attribute is used to style the link as needed. The page is divided into different sections, including a header, the main content, and a footer. Users can skip over the header and footer sections by clicking on the skip link. This example meets success criterion 2.4.1 by providing a mechanism, the skip link, for users to bypass blocks of content that are repeated on multiple web pages. Here's an example of how to use ARIA attributes in HTML in this example. The HTML code includes an ARIA label attribute to provide a label for the skip link, and an ARIA describe B attribute to associate the skip link with a description of what it does. The description is contained in a hidden div element with an it of skip instructions. The main content of the page is contained in a main element with an it of main content, which is labeled using the ARIA label B attribute. This example meets success criterion 2.4.1 by using appropriate ARIA attributes to provide context and information about the skip link and the block of content being skipped.